This discussion is going to be about Google and primarily about Google search. I think most people who have used a computer for any appreciable length of time know about how to search for things on the internet using Google. Uh, the word Google has turned into a verb. You can now Google almost anything. And that means search for information about it. But I don't know how many of you know how many different ways there are to search for information about something. I will go through that, but before I do, let me show you the basic navigation of Google. If you just put in www.google.com, you end up with a page that looks like this. And it starts out with the web highlighted. But there are many other ways to search. Here are some of them, and I will go through each one. But over here to the right, it says more. And that gives other ways to search and other places to search, some of which are not part of Google. And down at the bottom, there's a, another link to click that says even more. And when you do that, you get all sorts of Google products, including just plain old web search. This one here with the G in it to search billions of web pages, but also all sorts of other things. I am not going to cover all of them today because we'd be here for hours. So let's go back to the basic Google page and let's put in something that I happened to be searching for a couple of days ago. I'm going to do that by entering the thing that I am going to search for in my Google toolbar, which you can put up on your computer by putting Google toolbar in Google. <laughs> and it will give you a place to download Google Toolbar. I don't need to show you that. I already have it. There is an event that happens every summer in San Diego called the Pacific Islander Festival San Diego. It is a two-day event staged on the shores of Mission Beach, excuse me, Mission Bay, that involves great ethnic food from Guam, Hawaii, uh, Tahiti, and great performances and lots of booths to buy uh, Polynesian everything. And my wife and I have enjoyed that and I was looking to see when it was. So I looked for information about Pacific Islander Festival the Pacific Islander Festival held in San Diego. And the first thing I did was to put it in my Google toolbar, which is the same thing as putting it down here, and then click the search button. And sure enough, there it is. This is the official site of the Pacific Islander Festival Association of San Diego. And if you went there, you would find a photo gallery, and you would find news, and you would find all sorts of information, like when it was held, which was the weekend of uh, uh, September 25th and 26th, and some photos, and some past information about past festivals, and so forth. So that's the standard way that people search, and I'm probably not telling anybody in this audience anything they don't already know. Well, let's proceed now down the menu of Google, and let's leave this Pacific Islander Festival San Diego in the search box. Now if I click Images, you go directly to all the images that Google can find that talk about the Pacific Islander Festival San Diego or talk about Pacific or talk about Islander or talk about San Diego or probably even San Leandro 
because Google, unless you do a specific search with a quotation mark around it for a phrase, Google brings up things that match any one of these words, but it brings up the ones that match all of them first. So if you look at these pictures, this is a picture from the 2003 Pacific Islander Festival in San Diego. Here's one from uh, I don't know when, but it's, it's something that is at the Pacific Islander Festival in San Diego. Now if I click the link up at the top of this, it will show me the picture, but it will also show me where that picture came from. And over here I can click the website for that image and it will give me the entire document that that image came from. And maybe I have to scroll down a long way before I find the image that was at the top. There it is. Going back to the page of images and wandering down that page, you find many, many other things that pick up part of the phrase that we have in the box. Here's one for a, an Asian cultural festival in, of San Diego, which picks up only this, this, and this word in that box. And as we go down farther and farther and farther, we get to things like this. San Francisco's Treasure Island Music Festival. And you see that Google has highlighted the words that match. San, part of San Francisco, Island, part of the word Islander, music festival. So not everything that you find this way will be what you're really looking for, but sometimes it leads you to other interesting things. Now let's move along on the Google menu. I'm leaving the same phrase in the search box, but I'm going to click videos. And sure enough, here are a bunch of videos about the Pacific Islander Festival. Here's one from last year, October 12th, 2009. And here's one from 2008, and here are some more, some of which are not about the Pacific Islander Festival. This is the Pacific Islanders Club, and a video of it. This is from the festival, 2008. Here's another video from 2008. There are lots. Most of them, you'll notice, are on YouTube. But some are not. Some are Vimeo.com. Some are from Flickr. But most are from YouTube. Now every now and then you find a, a category in Google where there's no real result. 
for the phrase you've put in. Uh, I have not found anything on this map that comes up for Pacific Islander Festival San Diego which is really about the Pacific Islander Festival. There are things in there that talk about uh, Pacific Islander, like a Pacific Islander community. And there are things in there that uh, talk about San Diego, <laughs> but they don't seem to say much about, or there, there does not seem to be a map location here that is really the listing of where the Pacific Islander Festival is. That just means that no one has ever put the Pacific Islander Festival up on a Google map. So now let's move on through more of the Google search menu. We next click on news with Pacific Islander Festival San Diego still in the search box. And we find news items. Here's one from October. It says October 15th. I think that's when it was posted. Uh, yes, this is probably. F nope, that doesn't make sense. Let's see what it says. It says a documentary, One Voice to Open at Hawaii International Film Festival in October. So that is not really about the Pacific Islander Festival in San Diego. Uh, here's one that is. It says that uh, Governor Camacho is going to be in San Diego for the Pacific Islander Film Festival to represent Guam. He is the governor of the territory of Guam. So these are the sorts of things you will find about something you're searching for when you go to look at news. You may find things in uh, the Pacific Daily News, that's the Guam newspaper, I used to live on Guam a great number of years ago. Uh, here's one in uh, the North County Times about this year's Pacific Islander Fest Festival. And uh, in a uh, drink and eat travel blog, probably talking about all of the good things there are to eat at this Pacific Islander Festival. Yep, maybe and maybe not. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, it's probably buried in here. No, nope, there's a Latin American Film Festival and it looks like this is a news item in a news outlet for the LA area. Although further now further down in San Diego. This happens quite often. It's interesting. As you saw when I clicked on this I didn't see the portion of this particular news outlet blog that covered the Pacific Islander Festival. But here in the tech that comes up, it shows you that somewhere in that weekend what's up article, the words, the Pacific Islander Festival in San Diego will bring a little piece of Hawaiian culture to Southern California, Saturday 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. and it goes on. So quite often, you may find something in this summary that you have a heck of a time finding when you go to the actual page as I'm doing now because let's see how far down this goes yeah it goes a long way and it could be anywhere in there <laughs> 